What's up, guys? Uh, long time since I did it last my last voice tutorial, so this one is going to be on how to actually install my mods and do it quickly and easily. Um, my last tutorial on how to do it, it was a little bit wacky and it was just not not working at all whatsoever. Um, and this is going to be a lot more thorough and um, easier to understand. So let's get right into it. All right, so there's going to be one thing that you're going to want um, before you can install my mods. It's a program called WinRAR, um, and to download WinRAR, I'll I might put a link in the description for my I'll put links in my next descriptions for um, the site to download WinRAR. But otherwise, go to Google and search WinRAR. Um, it's the first link, and then you can download it. Um, from their site. Uh, it has all the versions that you need for um, whatever computer you're using, Mac, Linux, win, um, Windows, whole, the whole shebang. Um, and once you do that, you'll have the tool you need to install my mods. And so now we're going to actually download the mod. So to download my mods, what you're going to do is I have links in the descriptions for all of my all of my well not all of my mods but the ones that I have available for download right now so once you go to the video uh, as I said in the description there's a link to Mediafire which has um, all my mods that I currently have available and then you're gonna hit download once you click on the link and then you're gonna get a file a uh, zip file uh, it has that two there because I've already tried to do this tutorial twice and I've had too many problems and it's being annoying. So hopefully this works on this try. All right. um, once you do that, go to start and then computer. And we're going to go to the crisis directory. So once you do that, make sure you go to your local drive, program files, uh, electronic arts, crytech, crisis and then game in your game folder this is where you're going to be dropping all of the mods um, that you want to use to um, to install them and once you once you download the mod click on the file and then you are going to click and drag the mod in to the crisis game folder once you do that, you'll have the mod right here. And last step, open up the mod, then hit Extract to on Rinrar, and then just hit OK. And this should fix the problem from when you switch maps. Um, originally, someone had. Uh, commented that when um, the mod wouldn't work if they went on to a different map and so this is the solution that I found to get to that um, and once you do that it should be installed but just as a precaution because I've done this so many times we're gonna go check so once you do that um, open up the game and this is my asteroid mod so I believe it was a scar grenade mod So now we're going to check. Just open up any map that you're playing on or whatever. Or editing or making something. Whatever you're doing. Alright, let me make this a little bigger. Okay, move please. Thank you. Alright, I'm going to... Oops. Grenade. Launcher. Start the game. Let's see if this works. Stop. Uh oh. Oh, hold on. Let's see. There we go. There it is. I 
looks nice. And that is how you install my mods. Alright, and a uh, quick thing as well. When you're going to uh, install a new mod, what you're going to do um, is make a new folder. So you can just go into your crisis scheme or your crisis directory, make a new folder. If I can actually hit the word folder, that would be amazing. Thank you. Um, and just make a folder called mods. And then once you do that, you come on. Today is not my day. Up, please. Uh, take the mod. Please go up. God. And drop that into your mods folder. Okay. <laughs> Today is not my day. Um, make sure you exit out of the game before you do that. <laughs> and go up, please. This is being annoying. Move it into the mod folder. And make sure you also move the other one. Um, and that'll uninstall the mod. Uh, so then, if you want to... If you want to install another one, make sure you always move out the first one that you installed to avoid any potential problems. Um, if that's, I'm trying to think if I missed anything. Um, that should be it. I think that's it. Uh, if you guys have any questions, um, just leave a question in the comment section and I'll try to answer it as fast as I can. Right. Thank you for watching and have fun and enjoy the mods.